Hi, I'm Roger for Moonshine Designs Nursery and we get a lot of questions on what is a plug and what is a liner? Well, a plug is not something you plug into the wall for your, well I guess you could call it that, but that's not the type of plugs we're calling here. We're talking about the type you buy in flats that you can plant out in your landscape, which are generally bought in bulk. They come in several different sizes. I'm going to show you a couple of examples. Um, I should also point out first that all the plug flats are 11 by 22 and from there the count designates on how large the cell will be. For example this here which is a Vera Lavender plug is the 125 or 128 count cell size. This here which is a plug of Scotch Moss is the 72 count size and this which is a mint chip of Juga is the 50 count size. So if I put these side by side, you'll be able to, if I can separate them a little bit here, you'll be able to tell the difference in the size of the soil mass. That's what the count means. The top growth, this could depend on the variety, depend on the season. Obviously this little Vera Lavender plug is taller than the Scotch Moss plug, but lavender gets taller than Scotch Moss does. Uh, Juga is very flat growing. Uh, if you get something like a cat mint, you know, it may be this tall. But I, I hope that explains a little bit what plugs are. Now to differentiate between a plug and a liner, liners are usually small plants like this miscanthus right here that are shipped in individual pots. Uh, at least with, with our definition, a liner will be in a pot, a plug will be in a flat where they're, they can't be separated individually, just they could just be plucked out. With liners, you can actually take the pots out of the flats. Uh, we have two different size liners and ornamental grasses. One is a 50 count, where the pots are about two inches square. The other one is a 32 count, where you have this odd two by two and a half inch size pot. I hope that clears it up for you.